Y'all remember the first time I tried this? Yeah, I'm about to do it again, bro. Let's fucking go. Easy peasy. So from the giant nose hole for muscles and from the teeth formation, I can already tell this is a tapio. 100% this is a tapio. But I am confident I ain't wrong. And if I am wrong, well, <laughs> shit. No, tapirs are interesting because uh, you can tell they're within the same ballpark as elephants and rhinos and those goons because of their body types and articulate nose thingies and uh, among other things, of course. But uh, midway through drawing this, I actually realized I do not know how a tapir looks like. Or I do know how the silhouette looks like, I just don't know how the details look like because my eye was all out of whack. So... I may or may not have had to look at reference photos. Now I know originally I did this without references, but I'm sorry, the tape here, I was too stunned to figure out how the eye works. Because every time I drew the eye, it looked like a cartoon, it looked like a Peppa Pig. Now here's the finished tape here. Uh, let's see the original species and yeah, makes sense. It is a tape here. I was correct. Hopefully this time won't be as bad as last time, but we'll see. What's the next organism? Oh, oh, what the hell? Okay, uh, I seem to have run into an issue. What the hell are those side horns? Like, what what's going on there? It's, it's really just, what? I guess, usually in mammals, those side thingies are for muscle attachments. So maybe this is a really wide creature, like a wide boy. I'm gonna go with bear. <laughs> hopefully, hopefully I don't mess up. But yeah, so, that's the thing with bones, usually you have to just kind of like fill in the gaps that are pretty fucking big. So, uh, this is probably gonna be way off point. But I have also noticed while drawing this bear that I also don't know how to draw a bear. Drawing shit makes you realize, oh, I have not been paying attention to anything in my life. Because you'd think like a bear is easy, easy peasy, but no, my first bear looked like a, looked like a gentleman dressed as a bear. Like, this is the same shit, chief, like, well, well, whatever, whatever. So, yeah, well, drawing bear, I don't know what fun facts I know about bears. Bears are the current heaviest predators, biggest predators, you know, the the T-Rex category, like, those type of motherfuckers. A polar bear is basically undefeatable, like, if you, if you get hunted by a polar bear, you uh, uh, pray to you whatever fucking thing you believe in and if you're an atheist play, pray to like science or something <laughs> you ain't surviving it but yeah this is the finished product what's the original a chihuahua where 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 is the chihuahua there is no chihuahua in this scene bro locate the chihuahua that's the, re the reason why i thought it was a bear was because the side horns kind of remind me of like the bare muscle attachments that make the face wide. But a chihuahua? A little dog? What the dog doing? Man, like, <laughs> at least with the last video, I, I, I guessed within the family clade. Like, I guessed ungulate for the deer. Instead, I went with the horse. I fucking, like, I guessed canid for the Tasmanian tiger. But I went with a random self-created dog thingy. No, here, I just... Went way off point. I, uh, man. Let's, let's see what's next. Okay. One of my friends just straight up sent me a Dark Souls, like, boss. So, okay. Let's try to analyze this. Two lower jaw bones. Maybe snake. The teeth are too long and they look too see-through. Like, too, too, like, keratinous. So, I guess a fish. But what fish has teeth like that? A deep sea fish? At this point, I'm just guessing, you know. Uh, let's see, deep sea fish. This kind of reminds me of like a sea dragon, like a deep sea dragon fish, whatever the hell. It kind of looks like an angler fish, but the like attachments from the bottom. So I'm gonna try to like draw something similar, but fitting to the bone. So something completely different. Uh, you may notice that at some point I start drawing scales on this fish. It seems I have forgotten that deep sea fish are just like skin it's just there is no scales like or if there are scales they're extremely micro like very small uh, as you can see from some images of like deep sea organisms their skin is just flat but uh, i'm i'm trying my best you know what i'm saying and i i know man like for these drawings are usually short i like draw these within like less than an hour which is why they're very simplistic looking but this drawing turned out pretty nice you know like i, I like it uh but 
yeah, I can't help but think it's like a shot in the dark. Get, get it? It's, it's like it's dark. It's deep. Yeah, let's see. Let's see the original species. Monster. I n see. I went ahead and said, "Hmm, teeth too long, bottom jaw and multiple piece must be fish." Like, oh man, it was a snake. It was a python. It was a fucking viper. Whatever the hell. It's 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 a thing. It's a snake. Well, I haven't seen a single snake in my life that has teeth that big. I'm sorry. That's like, ah oh, man. Yeah, I I I be fumbling. Like. At least it was fun to draw, you know, like it's made me find out a couple of things about myself. Maybe I'll do like a third video of this style, like by next month, since this seems to be a monthly occurrence. But yeah, thanks for watching.